Hi everyone, my name is Erica. And I'm Mary Agnes. And we are Miss World Canada 2014 delegates. And we are so happy to be here. So Miss World Canada is a platform for women to express what she, what she truly believes in, to express and fight for a cause that is close to her heart. Being strong's a part of me, that's just who we are. Miss World Canada is strength. She has confidence. Miss World Canada is an awesome opportunity to accomplish so many great things. Miss World Canada is a fantastic experience. I'm out here chasing the stars. My name is Amber Kaur and this is Patrick Our home base is the Pacific Inn Resort and Spa. It is really pretty. It's pink on the outside, which I think as a Patrick girl we all love. This is Patrick Week, but there isn't just a pageant on Sunday. The whole week has been working towards developing us as humans. That came out really weird. Opposed to like apes. We've already made friends! Roommates! Oh yeah, oh yeah. Well, my roommate, she's horrible. That's no, I'm just kidding. She's actually really good. She's very quiet like me, but then she has this very quirky, fun side to her. She's like my match in a way. I think they kind of knew. They did some profiling on both of us and they matched us together. We matched perfectly. So I always like to be really goofy because I think it's important to have fun. And you can't be serious all the time. Nobody wants serious. <laughs> it's a different style of runway with a lot more fun and class and sass. The girls should be able to show up their personality. My best style is my face. So you know, I'm <laughs> My name is Karen Webrick. I am an event and delegate executive director with Miss World Canada. So what that means basically is um, my boss, the delegates around. I boss the delegates around. We plan events. We try to uh, make sure the girls have something fun to do. Oh jeez. <laughs> Did we take a selfie? Did we take a selfie? Let's do it. <laughs> I'm not normal. <laughs> yes, I traded an energy bar for a candle. <laughs> It's my first time being here in Vancouver and so far the experience has been unbelievable. Everyone has been so friendly and welcoming and I'm looking forward for the rest of the week. The competition has changed me in such a huge way, in a positive way. This is the first time I went away from home on my own without my family and I feel like I've grown so much since I came here. I'm more independent now, I'm more confident, I've learned so much. Everyone has been wonderful and I feel like I'm such a better person now thanks to everyone. And This experience has made me realize how beautiful everyone is and I'm so happy to have had this opportunity to be here.
children with exceptional needs deserve to develop to their best potential and we as delegates are showing them our love and doing philanthropic work to raise money so that they can also get the, their best childhood. Beauty with a purpose, you know that to us at Variety. Just thank you. Thank you. It was an amazing experience to see these children and hear these stories, and we're so happy to be able to help these children. It's an amazing feeling. They will choose one winner, and win or lose, I will go home with new experiences, new friends, and a new attitude. Also, under your seat, there is a life vest in case we land on water. <laughs> we were walking and we were practicing our rehearsal for the international part of the pageant. So, we've got a lot of really fun stuff ahead. It's going to be a lot of energy and it's going to be lots of fun. So, a lot of the girls did work up an appetite. I know I did. If you thought it was a mess that the Miss World Canada girls sing and dance on the bus, you were wrong. It's a Britney battle right now. they won't succeed in life. It's all about enjoying the moment, being yourself and just be happy.
because it's not just a pageant, it is a process. Every delegate who's been involved has done so much work and has developed themselves so much that I really believe that no matter who gets a crown or the crown, everyone can take something back with them. <laughs> this is my mom. <laughs> She's always supported me through everything. <laughs> Hi, my name's Narika and this is Bailey. We're from Blanche McDonald and we're here to get all the beautiful ladies ready and to do hair and makeup for them. You make me feel right, make me feel nice, make me feel like I'm in paradise. Miss World Canada, the journey has definitely changed me. If you were to look at me a year ago, definitely not as strong and as confident as I am today. Tonight I'll be shining on stage. There's a message that I'll be sending to the audience. That is, that as long as your dream and your passion is greater than your fear, you'll be able to achieve whatever that comes to you. Everything is okay. Do what? I'm going to be Shirley Temple today. Oh, nice. Oh, my God. They made me into a lion. Fun, flirty curls. Rawr. Take this experience as something they can grow from and learn from and leave their mark on the world. Regardless of whether you're a winner or a loser, this is just one aspect of life. And something else is going to come along, and you're going to be that winner. The first time I saw you, I knew that the light we have came up too late, washed away with the rain. And I'm really proud of myself, and I'm so happy to be here. Whoever wins, we're all queens. from the crowd and apply to myself and give it back again so whenever they're happy I'm happy and it just keeps going around so the happier they are the happier I am the happier I am the happier they are but it's it's an amazing feeling to be up on stage and it's so much fun I'm out of breath <laughs> Crazy, I'm crazy for feeling so lonely. I'm crazy, crazy for feeling so blue. And I, I was afraid. So afraid to try, then I heard, heard a word calling my name. Well, you are my rescue now, straight divine. No one can stop me now. Um, it's great, actually, the crowd is great. Um, and the lights aren't as bright as I thought you they would be, so you can actually see the crowd. I don't know if that's no more nerve-wracking or reassuring, to be entirely honest.
This is my shit You know I'm never giving up 